as we got there, there was apparently avoidable. Everywhere was calm. His introduction may have begun on a peaceful note, but his words after that is anything but. Accusations of bribery and attempts to rig the elections is what the coalition officer stationed at the Rumba North local government area is aggrieved about. A situation he says could have cost him his life. I was with her in her office. I saw there was heavy presence of police all around. No matter some of them who they did the election from wherever they came for their money, she refused to pay them their money. That's despite the fact that. The money was there. And I told her, I said, Madam, if the money is there, give them their money. Why not give them their money? They were endangering our lives. I told her, and she would have made me kill as well. Although I've been so traumatized, I couldn't really go into the details, but skeletally I've made some fact finding on, the, on my case. It's bootrest, everything is summarized here. I have, and I have evidence. Even the police who came with her can show that I was, it was under duress. If they call some of them, they could be found. How they surrounded me the whole night after I'd been tear gassed by her that caused me the room. I almost collapsed. The accused is the electoral officer sitting beside him. After listening with folded arms, she's given the floor to defend herself. The man here, if you can observe him, please. If you observe this man for 30 minutes, you will know he is not composed. We were watching him. He has said so many things about me. He has never had an experience of a, a, a how to on how to collect the uh, results. I sense that the, the place was tense up, and that uh, my, for my collection officers, being in their different collection center, could, something else could happen because some were hold hostage already. I was hearing several reports. I have to save their life by telling them to come over to the office. I made I put canopies for them. When he saw them collecting results here uh, from EC8A into EC8B, he said they were conducting election. He does not know the difference between conducting election and collecting election. Party agents lend their voices uh, to the issue. First. The representative of the All Progressive Grand Alliance, Abga, confronts the coalition officer for putting up a story after submitting a documented result. This coalition officer collected this result, signed it, and gave copies to all the party agents. When he was speaking, he said he was forced to sign it. Somebody who is under distress the way he presented it, could not have collected these results, very clean copies, no mutilation, nothing. Look at it and see. This is my, my own copy. There was no cancellation there, not even a line. And he signed it and wrote his name. However, the representative of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, wants a thorough investigation conducted. I listened very carefully to what he said. And I was able to distinguish that what he was talking about was that during collation, not during the election, but during the collation, he realized that eight Bs were mutilated. So eight C can be a clean copy, but the issue is that it does not disenfranchise the fact that the eight Bs were mutilated. And in such a situation, in such a situation, the right thing will have been. Please, sir, can we have peace? In such a situation, the right thing... Agent is... of Abga, please, sir. Can you just allow us to have peace, sir? The right process will have been to call for the 8 A's. And because the, what is mutilated is the 8 B. He could have gone back to collect the 8 A's doing the work of what the World Coalition officers ought to have done because this will have helped this process and make it more transparent than panic and disagree among themselves. This, the INEC resident officer says, will be looked into. The outcome of the findings is important as observers expect INEC 
to live up to his word on providing a safe and transparent platform for future elections.